Hello YouTube and welcome to the last part of my Hololive card unboxing. Looking for that signature card. Here we have five trial decks and without further ado, we'll just get right into it. For those of you who haven't watched the first video in this, I guess you could say quest or mission, you're basically looking for a signed card from Hololive. I opened up a booster box and to no avail, we did not receive one in there, sadly. This is my first time opening up a trial deck, so I'm assuming just like, you know, Yu-Gi-Oh! starter decks, you get your sort of manual. Yeah, so you get a sort of manual, all in Japanese, and you get like a cardboard or a paper playing mat. Yeah, I'm not going to open that. I'll just quickly put this back in there. And move on here we have the deck itself ready to be unboxed all right first deck oh let's be careful there very nerve-wracking slide this off so yeah let's get right into it This is sort of like the promo. Well, I guess it's not a promo card, but the card you get at the front, just your normal super rare. Put that aside. And let's just quickly go over this. Um, I'll just thumb through it. So yeah, it's basically kind of like a starter deck for those who want to get into the game. We have a lot of polka there, some botong. Um, pretty chill nothing crazy as you can see so far basically no hollows except for that first card right there and we get a triple rarity so as you can see it says triple R so we'll put that aside and that's about it for the first trial deck so yeah these are pretty uneventful um I don't remember what the chances are for an SP to be in a trial deck, but you either get the SP or I think it was this like sort of triple R or something else. Don't exactly remember the uh, rarity, pull rates, whatnot. So here you go, same thing. Let's just put that aside, open this up, take that out. Find damaging anything put that there all right next generation pull out this plastic I do like these little I guess you could say promo cards this one has aqua choco uh, Subaru uh, Shion that's Shion and Ayase Ayame bad names there you go so that's the second one here we can dump through it again some choco so these were pretty cheap to be honest um that's why i didn't mind buying like five of them these go for around 20 to 25 each um very cheap especially if you want to get into the game you can buy one learn some of the basic rules and have a ready to go deck here we have an Ayame. As you can see, it's a triple R. So yeah, I might be right. It might just be either a triple R or the signature card. So that's the second trial deck right there. Boom. I think I've only seen a couple or handful of videos in which someone pulls an SP from a trial deck. Um, so of course, my chances are, as always, abysmally low, just like in coin roll hunting. Um, I don't really have the greatest track record when it comes to pulling cool things. Here we have Coco, Toa, Luna, Watame, and Pipi Tensei. So let's quickly thumb through this one again. 
let's see, got some Toa. Up, oh, I'm pretty sure that means it's a triple R, if I'm not mistaken. Here we go, triple R. We got Coco. At least it's not. At least it's a different type of one. And nothing else here. Pretty cool though. There you go. Third trial deck. Here we opened up a fourth one. Uh, the dream seems to be potentially ending in a nightmare. Would very much like, as I said before in my other video, I would very much like a signed card. Um, not even to, uh, you know, just to have in my collection. Um, because at this point, even if I do get a signed card, selling it wouldn't really make me any money since I've spent, I think it's around roughly 200 on both the booster box and all these decks. Here we have Pecora, Flare, Noel, Marine, and Russia. Very nice card. I like Pecora a lot. All right, let's move on. Oh, that's a nice, that'd be a nice card to get in a hollow. The Cherry Blossoms, the Lanterns, Umbrella. That's actually a really nice card. Um, keep on going. More Pecora, Lucia. Oh, this is a cool. Um, for those of you who watched my booster box unboxing this is the card we got for our box topper very cool marine marine flare and here we have a noel triple r again truly a tragedy at this rate and yeah, last two cards, Noel in a bikini and Russia. All right. Last box. Sadly, I wish I was able to... I don't know if there was one, but the Suisse is my favorite of Hollow Life VTuber, followed right after by Pecora. We did already get the Pecora trial deck so I have one of her but I don't, I don't know if there's one of Suisse but the seller I was buying from at least didn't have it so a bit of a shame as I would have really been happy to get one of her all right here we have Shion Matsuri I don't remember her name um, or her and that is uh, Hato, I think it's Hato. Yeah. All right. Last time we thumbed through these. Let's see. <laughs> Sorry, that that face, that blank stare. Oh, that's a nice card. Mamatsuri. <laughs> uh, Hato. Shion. That's a lot of little break cards. Or not break. Ooh. It's starting to fall off my hand. Oh, cool. We got... This is a little different. So instead of a triple R, we got a triple R, but it was kind of like the cutscene card. As you can see, it says CX. That's pretty cool. I uh, didn't even know that could be a potential thing you can get. So that's cool. It's very different from your normal triple R. That's interesting. Basically, two swimsuits or three in the last cards. But yeah, let's quickly 
go over what we got. Sadly, no SPs. Very sad. Here we've got, you know, normal SR. Another SR of a different generation. Here's another one. Another one. And last but not least. Those are the SRs we pulled. And let's quickly go over the triple R's. First, we have this really cool one. CX triple R. Hollow Live. Here we have Noel triple R. Coco. Photon. And that's it. Whoop! That's it for the ride of trying to find that SP card that eludes us still. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. If, like always, you have anything you want to say in the video or just anything in general, you can always leave a comment down below and I will do my best to respond to it. Lastly, if you enjoy this sort of content, even though it's a bit on the rare side of me posting, uh, I usually post, if you haven't checked my channel out yet, I mostly post currency and coin type of videos. Um, you know, a subscribe always helps. Thank you so much anyway for watching this video. I know it's very different for my original subscribers, but it's still something I enjoy. So thank you a lot for watching this if you've seen through the entire video, and I hope you have a great day. Thanks again.